Many people left Original Medicare and their Medicare supplement to join a Medicare Advantage plan during last year's annual enrollment period between October 15th and December 7th. If you are one of those people, there's a very important consumer protection that you only have during your first 12 months on a Medicare Advantage plan that you need to know about, the Medicare Advantage trial right. The Medicare Advantage trial right is also available to people who join a Medicare Advantage plan when they first become eligible for Medicare. So whether you are brand new to Medicare and chose a Medicare Advantage plan for your coverage, or you were on original Medicare for any length of time and then chose to enroll in a Medicare Advantage plan, if you are in your first 12 months of Medicare Advantage coverage, you qualify for the Medicare Advantage trial right. In this video, we'll go through what the Medicare Advantage trial right is and how you can use it if you choose to do so. Hi, I'm Tabitha Moldenhauer, broker with Benefit Consultants Midwest. If you haven't already, please take a moment to hit the subscribe button. We have new helpful Medicare content every week. Anecdotally, we heard lots of reasons for switching from a Medicare supplement to a Medicare Advantage plan during the AEP last fall. Some Medicare supplement premiums had large increases during the year in 2021, and then all those policyholders got hit with the higher than expected Medicare Parts A and B costs for 2022. Those combined more than wiped out the increase to Social Security payments. In some places, Medicare Advantage plans that hadn't been as strong in previous years improved their provider networks and their coverage to be more of a viable option for people than they ever had been before. Regardless of the reason for making the change, everyone who is in their first 12 months in a Medicare Advantage plan has this really important consumer protection available just in case you end up not liking your Medicare Advantage plan and decide that you want to move back to Original Medicare. Let's first look at an example of someone who was on Original Medicare with a Medicare supplement and a standalone Part D plan and chose to enroll in a Medicare Advantage plan during the AEP. If you enroll during the AEP, your coverage begins January 1st. So that means your Medicare Advantage trial right runs from January 1st through December 31st. If you decide any time during that year that you would like to leave your Medicare Advantage plan and return to Original Medicare, you can. Your Medicare Advantage trial right allows you to disenroll from your Medicare Advantage plan, return to Original Medicare Parts A and B, enroll in a standalone Part D plan, and this is the big one, return to the Medicare supplement that you had before you enrolled in the Medicare Advantage plan without having to answer any health questions or go through medical underwriting. No matter what your health conditions are, your old Medicare supplement company has to take you back. You do want to coordinate your disenrollment from your Medicare Advantage plan with your enrollment into your Medicare supplement to avoid any time without coverage. You can apply for your Medicare supplement up to 60 days before your Medicare Advantage coverage ends and up to 63 days after your Medicare Advantage coverage ends. This is not something to procrastinate with. If you wait more than 63 days after your Medicare Advantage disenrollment to apply for your Medicare supplement, your Medicare supplement company at that point does not have to take you back without underwriting. If the Medicare supplement you had before enrolling in the Medicare Advantage plan is no longer sold by your Medicare supplement company, you can purchase a guaranteed issue plan from any company in your state. Plans available by guaranteed issue are A, B, C, D, F, G, K, and L. Plans C and F are only available to people whose Medicare Parts A and B effective dates are before January 1st, 2020. And Plans D and G are only available to people whose Medicare Parts A and B effective dates are January 1st, 2020 or later. Now let's look at an example with someone who is brand new to Medicare. 
If you became eligible for Medicare on May 1st and enrolled in a Medicare Advantage plan with an effective date of May 1st, your Medicare Advantage trial right runs from May 1st through next year, April 30th. If you decide anytime during that year that your Medicare Advantage plan isn't right for you, you can switch to Original Medicare, enroll in a standalone Part D plan, and purchase any Medicare supplement sold in your state without having to go through any health questions or any underwriting. The same timeline applies. You can apply for a Medicare supplement up to 60 days before your Medicare Advantage coverage ends and up to 63 days after your Medicare Advantage disenrollment. The Medicare Advantage trial right applies to both individual and group Medicare Advantage plans. So if you enrolled in your employer's group Medicare Advantage plan, you can switch to Original Medicare, purchase a standalone Part D plan, and a Medicare supplement anytime during the first 12 months. Now, most insurance policies have some kind of trial period or free look period when you can return the policy with no cost to you if you decide it just isn't right. Usually these trial periods are seven to 30 days. The Medicare Advantage trial right of 12 months is a really strong consumer protection that was built into Medicare Advantage legislation. If you have questions about the Medicare Advantage trial right or any questions particular to your Medicare coverage, please feel free to give our office a call at 877-312-1414 or visit bcmwi.com. We're here to educate you so you can find the best possible Medicare coverage solutions. Have a great day.